Sita Mittal and I am from OP General Model School. Here is my Kimat class and here I learned decimals in Kimat way. So let me show you how I do this. So this is a flat, this is a rod and this is a block. A rod is made up of 10 blocks. 1, 2, 3, 4 and 10. And a flat is made up of 100 blocks made up of 10 rods. Let us see how it works. The question is, how many rods perfectly cover the flat? As I know that 10 rods cover a flat. So let us see. So according to this, I have made this. So as I told that uh, 10 rod, rods perfectly cover a flat. So answer is 10. What fraction of a flat does the rod represent? A rod represents a 1 by 10 part of a flat. So 1, 2, 3 and they are 10 and this is 1. So 1 by 10. So um, it's step 3. Now consider a single rod and place it on the table. How many blocks put together match a length of the rod? So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So the answer is 10. How many blocks will exactly cover a flat? Answer this without covering an entire flat. So um, if a rod contains 10 blocks and a flat needs 10 rods, so it will be given answer and so uh, then we will multiply 10 into 10 so the answer will be 100. What fraction of a flat does the block represent? A block represent 1 by 100 part of a flat. So friends, you see that learning decimal in QMath way is so much fun.